Introduction. Today we are discussing the middle school FCS standard early childhood education. Explore the growth and development of the child ages birth to five. Specifically, we are focusing on the element of the standard of identifying and discussing nutrition and safety practices necessary when preparing meals for children. Nutrition education can be taught by helping children eat variety of foods and increasing their ability to be aware when selecting certain foods. It can also increase positive attitudes about food. Children often prefer sweets, salty, and some processed foods. When introducing new foods, you want to introduce them one at a time. New foods with familiar foods in them are helpful too. Serving in small amounts is better. When serving and introducing new foods to a child, it is best to do it when the child is hungry. Be a model and encourage them to eat it. Don't force them to eat it. You can try again later. Snack guidelines. It must have very little sugar, meaning very nutritious. Be creative and must be appealing to children. Be ready to look for those ingredients in the weekly grocery shopping and include a very nutritious healthy drink that is appealing to children. Childhood safety, choking caution. Children can ch choke on many types of foods like popcorn, raisins, and bite-sized snacks that can be swallowed without chewing. If a child is choking, encourage them to cough and don't pound on their back. Childhood safety food allergies. Make sure to post a notice to all employees about food allergies. Document all children with food allergies to avoid any risk of food allergies. Childhood safety cleaning. Wash hands for 20 seconds. Be sure to wash your hands after sneezing, coughing, touching your face or hair, and after using the restroom. Make sure to clean your hands before and after preparing foods. Clean the surfaces before and after cooking.